also some like your switch. Wow. <laughs> yeah, have what you don't know about this changeover. As you can see the changeover. Look at it very clearly. This is a conductor. This is another conductor. So when you insert your positive and your negative cable here, this is this is the one that will go to your building. This, this is the one that will go to your building, negative and positive, either positive or negative, or negative and positive. And this is another terminal here, negative and positive. You still have another one at the downside, negative and positive. So when you insert a negative and positive, if you switch it, if you take it up this way, you find that, as you can see, current has passed this way and move here. Another current have come towards this side and move here. So here is open, open circuit. You see it. So if you want your generator and you want to separate it, you can still pull it out from this other side and bring it down. So you see you have separated the you have separated the light, the supply from your from your either your cycle brake or main box the one that's coming from the pole you have you have separated it and this for the generator so we have now connected the generator directly as you can see directly to this terminal and the other terminal to this other side if you look under it's separated you see that here is rubber so this this long term here ended here it just ended only only at this side and the other end here as well so this is a change of home. for those people that are tired of using of changing but this is the easy thing that you can use very very simple this one can never burn or less the amp rating or less the amp you are using is quite smaller this is 100 amp but if you use this one in any electric plate it will go very very well just connected you remove the head plug of your electric plate just connected connect it here these two terminals i'm showing you that is the one for your electric plate if you just get your electric plate you put the negative and the positive here or you put the positive or the negative here now you will now use either the up or the down for your supply you bring your supply from your gb you just connected it either the up terminal or you don't like the up you use the down so so whenever you are done with it if you want to change if you want to switch if you want to cook, it will just switch it up. If you take it up this way, current will be flowing. It can be hard, difficult for this thing to get to this thing to get burnt. If you are done cooking, just pull it out. Either you put it down here that is not connected, that is not connected to, to anything. But if you want to cook, you can still take it back. As you can see, if you want to cook, you can take it back this way. For many of you that are scared of connecting, look at look at this terminal here. You will see something like you will see something like A and B. Likewise here, you will see it here. You see A. This is the A and this is the B. Up the same thing. A and B. So that is how all of them look like. So if you want to connect your positive or your negative, maybe your black or red wire, you can use either anywhere you connect A, you just come to the if you want to use up, you put it at the A 
upside you want to use that you still put it at the a downside but mind you here is for your input of your electric cooker why this upside is for your service cable if you want to maybe you want to use generator you can still put it here but this is only meant for changing either nepal lights or generator 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 light that's the main purpose of this i'm just giving you little secrets on what you can use this for so if you like what i'm doing please don't forget to share my video rockerman creative like share comment anything you know anything you don't understand please just let me know Mind you, if, if you see something wide like this, wide open like this, know that it's already spoiled. Because if you connect it, as you can see now, this one is spoiled. I'm just using, I'm just using it for experiment. You can see it's spoiled. If you want to use something like this, be sure that it's very stiff. As you can see this pole here, this one is not shaking. But this one is shaking. To tell you that it's already spoiled so if you connect it now why the thing is shaking like this and you connect it you find out that here will be overheating and that can bring electric breakout or can or can bring fire to the house so don't use something like this anything you find out that is shaking like this know that it's not good the one that's available to shake is this terminal here but whenever you, whenever you put cable and tight it it will be stiff, it will not shake. Please don't forget to like, comment, anything you don't understand. Just chat me up and respond to you.